Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are playing some more Vain Glory, guys. I'm going to be rolling with Saw. You saw two other guys wanted to be Saw, but I beat them to it. Um, I have been absolutely loving Saw. He is ridiculous. He does so much damage, and if you know how to control it, you can control the game. You'll see how much I just completely dominate all the other players in this game. Um... But I hope that you guys are enjoying this. So first off, what I'm going to do is pick the first ability. Um, it's kind of a, uh, it's a it's a melee attack ability, but it's also a speed ability. So I can use it to get away, but I can also use it to chase after somebody who is low health um, and do a good amount of damage to them. So with Saw, you definitely want to be in the lane. Uh, and if you saw my first purchase there, I got the Book of Eulogies, uh, which gives you a heal per kill. Um, so as I uh, stay up here in lane and as I attack, you're going to see uh, me get healed. As I kill these little minions, you'll see, I think it's like 35 health or something like that. Um, you'll see it pop up. Here's the enemy saw. He, he doesn't even want to mess with me. As you can see, he's a guest name, so I don't think he knows too much about the game right now. Um, but I am up here in lane and Ringo's with me. Um, honestly, he needs to leave. Ringo just needs to go down to the jungle. Uh, and hang out with uh, Taka, I believe, is down there as well. There you see that first ability in action. I was able to back up and get away. All three of the enemies are in the lane, which is a big no-no, guys. You do not want to have three people in the lane. Max, you want to have two. You might want to have three if um, the enemy team has two and you come out and gank them real quick and then go back in. But they have three in the lane for way too long right here. Um, and it is just not a good decision on their part because they are not getting that much gold. Uh, and gold is what wins the game, as you guys may know if you watched my uh, previous video. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get my second ability right there. It is that uh, chainsaw machine gun type thing that stuns them and does damage. Um, it's pretty good. I definitely like it. Um, again, you can see they still have all three in the lane right now. So I am getting a lot of gold. And they are getting practically none because A, my minions are probably getting a couple of the kills. B, they have three people trying to get uh, loot. And C, I'm distracting them and whatnot so they're just not able to get that much. Um, so it's very, very important to leave your laner alone. You should have one laner. If he needs help, come out and gank uh, from, the, from the jungle um, and kill some people. But then go right back in because otherwise he is going to be losing money. Uh, there's enough going on in the jungle for you to be able to uh, stay active as you move from side to side. There are four, uh, actually I guess it would be uh, six different uh, minions on either side for you in the jungle. We're about to take out this uh, jewel, but she was able to get away. I should have used my first ability right there, but I do take out that petal right there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put another point in my second ability, uh, and I'm going to head on back, spend some money. Uh, get those recommended items guys it's, it's definitely good to get recommended but it's also fun to kind of explore and see what else you want um, a lot of times I will uh, a lot of times I'll get boots just especially for saw because he's so slow I'll go ahead and get boots just so that he can uh, dominate some people and just have some speed with him um, it's very important to uh, to kind of explore and just see what kind of items are out there for you to use. So we're just going to head back down the lane. As you can see, I'm level 3 right now. Um, I feel like th there might be another level 3 on the other team, uh, but most likely level 2 being in the lane. Yep, so that jewel is a level 2. Uh, their saw is a level 3. I'm not too sure how when they have so many people up in the lane, but we are about to own jewel because she's going to come in range of this turret. <laughs> and uh, it's going to make her speed away as quickly as possible um, but we're just gonna stay up here for a little while keep working uh, our jungler or Taka is doing really well down there uh, because the jungle is pretty much open because they have two to three people in the lane up here with me which is just ridiculous it really is too much um, but we're just gonna keep on moving keep on progressing uh, gonna try and get a couple shots off on the turret right here uh, my minions are about to come and help so we're gonna back up get right back behind them and then head back in. It's always, always important to have your minions in front of you guys, especially as you're approaching a turret, because then the turret 
can focus on the minions and not you. Also, as Saw, you can see those 12 stacks on the top left of the bottom. Um, that Saw is about to get wrecked. Watch this. Boom! <laughs> I knew where he was heading, so I put my thing there, and he walked right into it. Get wrecked. But you can see that little 12 count thing in the bottom left of the screen that keeps, uh, it looks like a clock. Um, that's my spin of my gun. So this machine gun takes a while to warm up, but once it's warm, it will wreck. I just took out Jewel. She tried to come out. I don't know what the heck she was doing. Um, but that spin cycle, the higher it goes, the slower you go. So as you're attacking a turret, you have to pay attention to that because if you're at 12 stacks and you only have two minions left, you need to start moving. Otherwise, you're going to be too slow and the turret's going to hit you by the time it kills the minion. So you got to pay attention to that. Uh, this saw is coming up in here, and I don't know why he's doing that because it's just not smart. <laughs> it's just not. What is he doing? I mean, come on, saw. <laughs> why are you challenging me, bro? So um, we're doing good. We're still just taking out all of these minions. We've got our spin up to 12 in the lane. So guys, one thing that you need to pay attention to when attacking a saw is that you need to see when he most recently attacked a lot of characters because um, if his spin is on full, then you're done because he's going to attack so fast. He's going to attack ridiculously fast and you really have to be careful. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use my second ability right there. Slow down Jewel. She's going to be dumb enough to stay in here once again, guys. And what's going to happen? We're going to take her out. See, that was a good time for Taka to come up because Taka was able to help me out. I might have died there, um, but we're still doing good. I'm going to head on back. I just got my ult ability, which shoots these big missiles, and my spin is up to 12, and I use my ult. Ooh, it's dirty. But there you go. You see me purchasing those boots. We're just going to try things out a little bit differently this time. Saw is so big that I need him to be faster. So that is why I went ahead and purchased those. Um, I am significantly ahead of the other people um, in this game right now when it comes to gold and whatnot. So I'm not too worried about buying items like that because I'm already ahead of the game. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just get our spin up. We're going to work on all of these minions. And once again, Jewel is going to come in here. And I don't even understand why. <laughs> um, I could have used my first ability right there, but we're just going to let uh, we're gonna let Ringo head on out. See if he can do a little bit of damage. Um, <clears throat> and we're going to take out the rest of these minions as our minions come in and as we get closer to this turret. So right now you'll see that we have four minions. And once again, my spin is at 12. So you'll see I'm going to back up at a certain point. But I actually think these minions last long enough. Uh, that will be fine. Um, I'm just going to keep focusing on this turret and that Ringo doesn't know how the game works guys. If there, if you are in range of a turret and you attack an enemy player, the turret will attack you. So that's why that Ringo just got attacked even though there were some minions around. Um, so you got to be very careful of that. I'm going to go ahead and take out this turret right here, get our team 300 gold and then say, oh excuse me Saw, but uh, I'm coming for you man. I am coming for you. He's right up there and one, two, and three, he is down because I ulted him. You can see that I still have two missiles left in the bottom left right there, and my spin was on blast. Here we go with Jewel. I think that she might get me. I'm not too sure right here, but what do we do? No, I think that I, yeah, what happens, what happens? Yeah, so she barely, barely got me right there. Um, wait, no, did I get her? The minions killed her, I think. Um, so we're going to go ahead, go back into our shop. I'm looking around at some of these items. I'm like, hmm, 600 health? Uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, but we just head back up to the weapon and get the recommended weapon right here just so that I can do even more damage. There's that book of eulogies uh, in that bottom corner that you saw me buy originally. <clears throat> but we're just going to head back out, guys. We're going to keep on doing some work. Um, just keep on pushing forward. And, uh, and working on these guys. You can see that there's their saw once again, and I don't know what he's doing. He does have a better spin than me right now, but you know what that also means? That means that he is slower than me. So I'm gonna get him right there before he ports. If you want to escape and port home, at least go in the jungle and do it, <laughs> because that right there was exactly what killed him. He didn't go far enough. He could have gotten away from me, but he didn't go far enough for the port. Now, Jewel's coming back after being almost dead. I don't know why she just did that. Thanks for feeding me. <laughs> so she just gave me an extra kill right there. We're going to go ahead and put another point in our ult, and we are going to do work. Again, guys, the ult is the third ability or the ultimate ability. Um, you can call it whatever you want to. 
Uh, people that play League always call it the ult. Um, but we're just going to sit here in the bush, and I'm going to camp for a second and see what happens because I can see that their enemy teammate is uh, in the lane. It's that saw again, and he is about to walk right on by with no idea that I am in this bush right here. Uh, camping is okay, guys, because it can be really, really important. So I camp right there. Um, I jumped out too soon, as you can see. Uh, I thought that he was going to be with that group, but he actually wasn't. So we're going to go ahead and focus on him. Uh, and I believe that we use our ult right here. One, two, and then we're going to turn over to that jewel. One, two, three, and four. And she is done for before she can even get her stun off. Um, so Saw, if you know how to use him, guys, is ridiculous. We're 10 and 1 and 1 right now. As you can see, I had my spin up before I used my ult. You want to get your spin up at least a little bit before you use it. Um, but each bullet of the ult gives you two spins, so you are going to build it up. Um, but if it's already built up towards the beginning of it, then obviously that is going to make you do a lot better than if it was not. Um, so we're just going to keep on doing what we've been doing. We're going to try and clear this out a little bit. I have to be careful because I am close to being in range of that turret. We're going to go ahead and attack that jewel and take her out. And we are going to move on to the turret right here with all of our minions. And we are going to just annihilate it and get ourselves some more gold. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put that point in that first ability, and you can see that we have 2,200 gold right there, guys. What am I supposed to do with that? I don't know. That's too much money. <laughs> um, but I realized that in this game as it went on that I uh, just kind of forgot about how much money I had because I was just annihilating people. Um, so we're just going to head down here into the jungle. I'm going to sit right in here because you can see their petal is right at the entrance of their base. There goes her little ability. Um, so we're going to see if she comes out. Um, a lot of time, if you pay attention to the map, you'll be able to do that. Um, she, however, does not come out. So I'm just going to build up my spin because I know that she's in the area. Uh, you can see that I'm way ahead of everybody right there if you guys want to freeze that. Um, but we're going to go ahead and focus on this Jewel. She's going to use her little ability on me. And I'm going to say, uh, I don't think so, Jewel. But I do believe that she takes me out right here. Yeah, so she does take me out. Um, because I should have moved out of her ult. That big thing that you saw earlier was her ultimate. But it's okay because it gave me a free port back and I can uh, and I can buy some things with all of that gold that I have. So I wasn't too worried about that. Um, we've got two more seconds, so we're going to go ahead and wait that out and then head on back. Um, there's Taka as well. You can see Taka's level 10. I'm level 11. Um, and I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> right here, just standing. I'm admiring the scenery. Um, there we go. I think that uh, somebody was talking to me outside the room or something. But we're going to go ahead and use our boots right there just to get back into the action. That's another reason why I love getting those boots. But you can see that their jewel is right there, and we need to get her back. But there's saws there as well, so I'm going to build up my spin. We're going to go ahead and use that ability. Take saw out and then switch over to jewel. Use this. Here we go. Get it, Jewel, but the only thing is it made me pop too far back uh, to finish taking her out. So we're going to head back to our minions. Uh, I'm going to get those minions off of me, hop into this bush, and we're going to wait just a second and see what happens because I know how that Jewel plays, and there she comes right back. One and two. Get out of here. She needs to go back and heal more or go to that single boss in the jungle and heal up. That's one thing that you'll see me do a lot. That's one of my strategies when I don't want to go all the way back. I'll go and deal damage to that boss and give myself another, shoot, I don't know, 30, 40% health. Um, and it'll keep me in the action for a little bit longer. Um, especially if I have, as I have my crystal energy. Um, we're going to go ahead and focus on this saw. He's only level 8. I'm going to wreck him right now and say buddy don't mess with me and then we're going to switch right over and here comes that pedal we're going to use our first ability and get out of dodge because i do not want to die uh so you can see that's a great use of that ability but watch what i do here i go and hide in or <laughs> i almost hide in the bush but i at least go back and stand by my turret um you have to make sure that you are safe 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 um so i'm i'm Messing around with some of the other uh, items here. You can see this one's kind of cool for health regen and whatnot. Um, I'm doing some push-ups here on the stage. But I'm just kind of doing random builds here. 
Uh, and trying to figure out what works for Saw because recommended might not always be best for your play style. Um, I stay in the action and um, I definitely want to be able to heal. We are 21 and 4 right there. I have two thirds of the points, 14, 2, and 1, guys. And we're going to head back up in here to this jewel who just pushes way too hard. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use that ability and boom, take her out <laughs> with that number one ability, which is just. Awesome, that thing is ridiculous. And guys, it also works to get you out. You can use it as kind of an escape mechanism. Uh, if you pop your boots, um, or if you hit them, and then pop your boots right after that, you'll be fine. Let's see if we can get some people down here, but you can see right there that their pedal is down here. I just saw her little flower things walking around, so I'm gonna go ahead and switch to her. We're gonna use this ability, we're gonna get up on her, and we are going to slow her down just a little bit. Um, I popped my boots right here in an effort to try and get up to her, but my spin was at 12, so it was too slow. But we were able to get a good amount of damage done so that Taka could finish taking her out. Um, so we're 15, 2, and 1 here, guys. Moving on into the base, we're going to go ahead and focus on this turret. Once again, that jewel does her special to me, um, and I get a little bit too close so that turret focuses me. Um, I am now out of range of that turret though and this jewel is going to jump and stun me but again I'm level 12 and I've got Taka with me so we're gonna take her out um, very very quickly. Uh, my spin is at 12 so I am a little bit slower right now but we're gonna go ahead move on in here um, and try and uh, take out this turret. We've got Taka with us we definitely want to try and take it out. I'm gonna focus on these minions to get my spin up a little bit and then focus on this turret as well. We're gonna go ahead and ye <laughs> No, I clicked the wrong direction. <laughs> so that happens sometimes, guys, where you'll click on an ability and if you want to undo it, you have to re-click on it. Um, I forgot to do that and I just clicked, I thought I clicked off, um, but that isn't how it works. So um, I messed up there, used a whole bunch of my energy and whatnot. So we're gonna go ahead and come back in and get our spin up. Um, which again is his numbers in the bottom left and we're gonna go ahead and take out this turret because we want a good entrance into this base. Um, my spin is up still at 10 so I'm gonna turn right before it goes away and focus on that jewel. Let's see if we can keep it up. We can't but that's okay because <laughs> we're just going to keep on hanging out in this area. We're gonna wait for our minions to come and we're gonna take out that jewel right there. I just suck it up and I take her out. Um, and then what happens? I die. <laughs> but that's okay because it was one for one. I've got 2,000 gold, so I needed to head back anyways. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and take her out, head back to the shop, spend some money, money, and get some better items. Um, so we've got 20 seconds right here uh, to cool down. So I'm just going to sit over here and watch. That turret is almost down. Um, Ringo is only level 8. Uh, and the talk is level 12 with me um, so he I don't know what he was doing but um, you just have to make sure guys that you are uh, constantly doing stuff in this game you can camp for a little bit but if nobody comes roll out because you have to level up if there is an enemy team uh, mate that is the same level or that's the same character as you in a higher level then it's gonna be hard to come back from that um, their saw isn't the same level as me and hasn't been this whole time because I was able to take him out um, and pretty much just dominate him the whole time. So I watch out for Jewel's ability right there. We're going to go ahead and get our spin up because we know that she's close. We're going to focus on her and she is going to regret coming in and trying to stun me. Um, one, two, three, and there's the enemy saw. He's only level nine. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just take him out real quick and I have more of my missiles available. We're gonna go ahead and just take out this turret. One and two, come on, take it out. And then we're going to switch over to the pedal in just a second. Uh, once we take that out, there goes the pedal. She's focused now, but she realizes that her turret is done for, so she's going to retreat. Um, and we're just gonna kinda hang out here for a second. Uh, we're 20 minutes in, the Kraken has not been released at all. We're gonna go ahead and um, do a little bit of damage to their jewel again. She is level 10, um, but we're going to jump back right there, use that first ability, and take her out. We are 19, 3, and 1, guys. Just doing some serious work with Saw right now. Um, I'm really starting to like him. I'm really starting to learn him. 
Uh, I believe this was only my third game playing with him. In the game before this, if you guys check my Twitter, uh, I went like 21, uh, 21 and 4 and 6 or something like that. So uh, that one was even a better game. But as you can see, I'm just going to come down here, passively attack this guy, not use any of my ability, and get my health back up. Um, and then we're going to head over to the center and see if we can take out the Kraken. Because he is clutch, guys. If you can get your team in there to take out the Kraken, that's very important. We just killed a bunch of them, so we're going to head down here. I'm going to get my spin built up, and then I'm pretty sure that I just used my missiles on him. Yep. So we're going to go ahead and just use our missiles and deal a whole bunch of damage to the Kraken so that she can go over there and wreck. I'm pretty sure she's a she. Uh, I'm not too sure. But here comes an enemy pedal, and we are just going to annihilate her. Uh, pedal does do a lot of damage. You have to be careful of it. I don't know what just happened there. <laughs> I used my ability on pedal and retreated, retreat, <laughs> retreated back to this guy. But we're going to go ahead and kill him so that we can get that health bonus once again. Um, and then we're going to head back into action. Here comes Jewel, and she pretty much regrets coming out here. I don't know why she turned around. Uh, she wanted to try and use her ult and see if she could do some damage, which I guess is good because she knew she was going to die. Um, so she wanted to try and help her team out a little bit by causing some extra damage. We're going to go ahead and see where they're at, um, and it doesn't look like any of them are coming out. Uh, guys, one thing that I want to mention is in the bottom left, you can see those three abilities that are lit up. One of them is a heal, one of them is a shield, and one of them is my boots. Uh, some items have those, and you need to pay attention to that. If you buy the boots, you're going to get that. You can click on it. It has a cooldown, but it's also going to help you uh, run faster. So we are going to go ahead and just take this out. I really wanted to try and kill that pedal at the end, um, but we're just going to head back in here, take out this crystal for victory, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all enjoyed. And as always, make sure you keep calm and play on for me, right? Peace!